ओके क्वेश्चन नंबर टू एक्सरसाइज थ्री पॉइंट फाइव ठीक है क्वेश्चन नंबर टू एक्सरसाइज थ्री पॉइंट फाइव For which values of a and b does the following linear pair of equation have infinite solution? So, two first number is given. Two x plus three y equal to seven. A minus b x plus a plus b y equal to three a plus b. माइनस ठीक है तो क्या करेंगे फर्स्ट वी कन्वर्ट इट इन टू द फॉर्म ऑफ ए वन एक्स प्लस बी वन वाई प्लस सी वन इक्वल टू जीरो एंड ए टू एक्स प्लस बी टू वाई प्लस सी टू इक्वल टू सी ठीक है तो क्या बन जाएगा ये हमारा हो गया टू एक्स प्लस थ्री वाई माइनस सेवन इक्वल टू जीरो ए माइनस बी एक्स ए प्लस बी वाई माइनस थ्री ए प्लस बी माइनस टू इक्वल टू जीरो तो व्हाट वी गेट एयर फोर A one equal to two, B one equal to three, and C one equal to minus seven. Okay. A two equal to A minus B, B two equal to A plus B, and C two equal to minus of B A plus B minus two. Okay. It is given that for infinite solution. or in finite solution what is the condition the condition is a1 upon a2 equal to b1 upon b2 equal to c1 upon c2 okay this we had discussed on last class a1 upon a2 equal to b1 upon b2 equal to c1 upon c2 okay so we get Two upon a minus b, b upon a plus b equal to minus seven upon minus of three a plus b minus two. Okay. Therefore, a minus b by two, a plus b by three, b a plus b minus two upon seven. फर्स्ट टू इक्वेशन ए माइनस बी बाय टू इक्वल टू ए प्लस बी बाय थ्री तो आफ्टर क्रॉस मल्टीप्लाइंग वी गेट बी टाइम्स ऑफ ए माइनस बी इक्वल टू टू टाइम्स ऑफ ए प्लस बी एंड वी गेट a minus 3b 2a plus 2b सबको एक साइड में लिख जाएंगे 3a minus 2a is a minus 3b minus 2b means minus 5b equal to c okay so consider this as equation number one now we consider now we consider second and third So we get a plus b upon three, b a plus b minus two upon seven. After cross multiplying, we get seven times of a plus b equal to three times of b a plus b minus two. So on multiplying, we get seven a plus seven b, nine a plus three b minus six. ठीक है 
सभी को दूसरे साइड लेके जा रहे हैं तो जीरो इक्वल टू नाइन ए प्लस थ्री बी माइनस सिक्स माइनस सेवन ए माइनस सेवन बी ठीक है तो इट विल बी नाइन ए माइनस सेवन ए ठीक है नाइन ए माइनस सेवन ए कितना हो गया नाइन ए माइनस सेवन ए हमारा बन गया टू ए जीरो इक्वल टू टू ए फिर थ्री बी माइनस सेवन बी माइनस फोर बी माइनस सिक्स तो वी गेट टू ए माइनस फोर बी इक्वल टू सिक्स आफ्टर टेकिंग टू कॉमन वी गेट ए माइनस टू बी इक्वल टू सिक्स तो अवर सेकेंड इक्वेशन विल बी ए माइनस टू बी इक्वल टू कंसिडर दिस एज इक्वेशन नंबर टू तो मैंने डिलीट नहीं किया इसलिए टेंशन मत लो इस पेज में हम दोबारा रिटर्न हो जाएंगे ठीक है तो हमारी लास्ट इक्वेशन हमारे जो लास्ट के जो दो इक्वेशन थे मैं उनको दोबारा लिख रहा हूं फर्स्ट इक्वेशन इज फर्स्ट इक्वेशन इज ए माइनस फाइव बी इक्वल टू जीरो वन इंप्लाइज ए माइनस फाइव बी इक्वल टू जीरो एंड टू इंप्लाइज ए माइनस टू बी इक्वल टू थ्री टू इंप्लाइज ए माइनस टू बी इक्वल टू थ्री तो इन बोथ इक्वेशन द साइन बिफोर ए फर्स्ट थिंग इज द कोफिशियंट बिफोर ए ठीक है इज सेम एंड साइन बिफोर ए इज ऑल्सो सेम सो वी सब्रैक्ट फर्स्ट इक्वेशन फ्रॉम सेकेंड तो ए ए विल गेट कैंसल माइनस फाइव बी प्लस टू बी दिस विल बी माइनस थ्री बी इक्वल टू माइनस थ्री तो बी इक्वल टू वन बी की जो वैल्यू है ये हमारी बन गई वन तो बी इक्वल टू वन ना वन इंप्लाइज एक्वल टू फाइव बी दिस इक्वल टू फाइव देर फोर सोल्यूशन इज एक्वल टू फाइव एंड बी इक्वल टू ठीक है सो दिस इज द आंसर ठीक है so the condition is for what value of k the following pair of linear equations have no solution so condition is equation is 3x plus y minus 1 equal to 0 k minus 1 into x plus a minus one into y minus two k plus one equal to zero. Okay. So first we find a one, b one, c one, a two, b two, c. Okay. So a one equal to three, b one equal to one, c one equal to minus. Okay. A two equal to two k minus one. B two equal to k minus one. C two equal to minus of two k plus one. Okay. So for no solution, what is the condition? A one upon A two equal to B one upon B two, but this is not equal to C one upon C. So mainly we have to find a one upon a two equal to b one upon b two. If after putting the value of k from first two condition, okay, a one upon a two equal to b one upon b two. If it is not equal to c one upon c two, then we can consider that one, okay. So b upon two k minus one. Equal to one upon k minus one. So after cross multiplying, we get three times of k minus one equal to two times of k minus one. 
2k minus 3, 2k minus 1. So, 3k minus 2k equal to 3 minus 1. So, we get k equal to, okay? If we put k equal to 2 in c1 upon c2, k equal to 2 me kya banega? 2k plus 1. 2k plus 1 ban jayega. 2 2 is 4 plus 1. Matla 5. So c1 upon c2 will be 1 upon 5. Also, for k equal to 2, c1 upon c2 equal to minus 1 upon minus of 2k plus 1. Minus minus will be cancelled. 1 upon 5. Therefore, for a equal to 2, a1 upon a2 equal to b1 upon b2, but not equal to c1 upon b2. Okay? So, answer is k equal to, okay? Not correct. Next question is solve the following system of linear equations by L substitution and cross multiplication method. So, question number three you can do. Okay? We start question number four. Okay? Question number four, we start kare. question number three. Tum log asani se kar sakte. So, we start question number four first. Number. Huh. What is given? It is given that a part of monthly hostel charge, okay, a part of monthly hostel charge is fixed and remaining depends on the number of days one has taken food in the maze. Okay, tum log bhi apne apne notebook mein apne apne book mein dekho, NCRT ki jo book hai usme dekho kya diya ho. So page number sixty three hai, okay. A part of monthly hostel charges is fixed and remaining depends on the number of days one has taken food in the maze. Okay? So, we can consider let fixed charge of hostel a yeah, maze. Fixed charge of maze equal to x and Per day charge equal to y. Okay? Per day charge equal to y. Next. When a student's A takes food for 20 days, she has to pay 1000 as postal charge. Therefore, According to question for student A, okay, for 20 days she has to pay rupees 1000, okay, so x plus 20 into y equal to 1000, okay, take a one day charge hai, y rupees, two days ho jayega. 2y, 3 days, 3y. So for 20 days, it will be 20y. And also fixed charge is added, that is x. x plus 20y equal to 1000. So we consider this equation as equation number 1. Okay. Now next, for student b, for student B, who takes food for 26 days. So, x plus 26y equal to cost is 1180. This is equation number 2. Okay. Find the fixed charge and cost of food per day. Look, here is question mein likha to nahi hai. Solve this by cross multiplication or solve this by substitution 
or solve this by elimination. But in this question, the coefficient of x are same. So it is very simple to solve this by elimination method. Okay. So therefore, subtract equation one from equation two. We get okay. Subtract equation two from equation one. We get sorry. Equation one from equation two. We get so x plus twenty six y equal to one 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 eight zero. X plus twenty y equal to one thousand. तो सब्ट्रैक करेंगे एक्स एक्स विल गेट एक्सल ट्वेंटी वैल्यू ऑफ वाई इज थर्टी मीन्स पर डे चार्ज इज थर्टी तो बाई पुटिंग दिस वैल्यू इन इक्वेशन वन वी गेट एक्स इक्वल टू 1000 minus 20y. So 1000 minus 20 into 30. X equal to 1000 minus 600. So it implies that X equal to 400. Okay? Implies that X equal to 400. Therefore, fixed charge equal to four hundred rupees. And per day charge equal to thirty. Okay, fixed charge four hundred rupees per day charge thirty rupees. Okay, so note it down. Okay, so second number, question number four, second part. Okay, a fraction becomes one by three when one is subtracted from numerator. Okay. So first condition is we consider let fraction equal to x upon y. Now, according to question, it becomes one by three when one is subtracted from numerator. So x minus y equal to one upon three. So after cross multiplying, we get three times of x minus one equal to y. P x minus three minus y equal to zero. So our equation will be P x minus y equal to three. Equation number one. Next, it becomes one by four when eight is added to the denominator. Now second condition according to question. If eight is added to the denominator, it's x upon y plus eight. It will become one upon four. So we get four x equal to y plus eight. Four x minus y equal to eight. You okay? get again here the sign before y. In both equation is same, so it is better to solve this by elimination method. Okay, so what we will do? Subtract equation one from equation two. We get what will be? Four x minus y. Equal to eight. P x minus y equal to three. 
माइनस प्लस माइनस तो सब्ट्रैक्ट करने पे साइन चेंज होता है फोर एक्स माइनस थ्री एक्स विल बी एक्स एट माइनस थ्री इक्वल टू तो एक्स इक्वल टू फाइव इज द सोल्यूशन ठीक है आंसर Now, after putting this value in any one equation, now one implies y equal to three x minus three. Okay, y equal to three x minus three means three into five minus three. So y equal to fifteen minus three का मतलब हो गया. So at last, we write the answer. Therefore, fraction. Equal to x upon y equal to five upon okay. So note it down. Do it fast. We can do one more question. We have limited time, so do it fast. Let's go. Yash scored forty marks in a test, getting three marks for right answer and one marks for wrong answer. Let number of right answer equal to x. Number of wrong answer equal to y. Okay. So first case, we get to have forty marks. According to question, क्या बनेगा? Three marks for right answer, मतलब three x and one marks for wrong answer. This equal to forty. ठीक है? Second condition is four marks for right and minus two marks for wrong. So next condition is four x. Minus two y and he got fifty marks. Okay, क्या करेंगे? So equation two में लेते हैं. मैं two common लेके cancel कर लेते हैं. Two x minus y equal to twenty. One minus two implies three x minus y equal to forty. Two x minus y equal to twenty five minus plus 